Hey guys, this is Sweet Nightingale here, and I just have just a few things to say. I'm kind of doing like a little, I don't know, I guess call it sort of an update video, uh, an informative thing too, because there's something that I need to tell you about that a lot of people have been having some issues with. But first of all, um, I do want to say that um, I'm recording this on Thursday night. This is Halloween, uh, Halloween night, so I hope you guys are having a really good time. And those of you that went out trick-or-treating and stuff, you got lots of good candy and lots of good treats and stuff, all that good stuff. Those of you that did the haunted house thing, I hope you didn't get scared too bad. You know how the Sims get, they get scared really bad and then they pee themselves, but <laughs> hopefully um, hopefully that didn't happen to any of you guys. Anyway, um, so I am going to be gone for the weekend. I'm leaving tomorrow, but I will make sure that I have a few things for you guys to watch while I am away because I'm not going to be able to upload Saturday. Uh, I'll try to put some stuff up tonight and then uh, tomorrow before I actually go. And then we are going to be coming back Sunday, but I don't know if I'm going to be uploading Sunday either because usually when we have a meeting like this, it's, it's pretty exhausting. Uh, it has to do with my Lions Club stuff, so... Uh, it's one of those times where I have to be away the whole weekend, but I'll make sure that I keep you guys happy because, you know, I, I know that you guys will want some stuff to watch and you guys get a little worried when I'm away for a couple of days without any uploads. So I'll make sure you guys get your little Sims fix. <laughs> Now, um, something that I wanted to inform you guys about, and I've been reading a lot of this like on the forums and just different places and stuff now, uh, and you'll be seeing this in a couple of parts into my End of the Future LP. Yes, I do have a couple of parts recorded. Now, I found a fix for this, and it's it's a little tricky. Hopefully, they're going to come out with, a, with a, a fix for this because this is really bugged. Uh, when you get the Time Almanac, you know, when the time traveler gives you the, the time almanac, you got that little icon on your, um, you know, right next to your smartphone and your, your journal and all that. But a lot of times, and I heard that this is going to happen to everybody eventually, unless, unless it's fixed. But uh, what happens is uh, eventually when you try to click on that time almanac, it will not open. It just clicks and clicks and nothing will happen. You can't really use it. You can't interact with it. Uh, some people say they can't interact with the legacy statues. What happens is, and I guess it's a bug, but uh, what happened is there's some people that use these mods and, and you know, a lot of it is from, um, you know, from Twalin's page. It's the NRAAS home. And this is where I get like my once read mod and my anti-magic scroll and the extra careers and stuff that I have. But anyway, what happens is... Um, they had a, there was an older version of a mod called Overwatch, which is kind of like a, like it cleans up a lot of the errors and a lot of the loose ends or whatever. But um, if you have like an older version of Overwatch installed, the problem happens a lot quicker. But even if you don't have that in there, it will happen eventually, according to what I read. I will provide the website that I learned this on. Now, an, a way to fix it is to get the newest version of, of Overwatch. I think, you know, I think it's like version uh 76 or 79 or something like that but get the if you if you're the type that will use a mod uh get the newest version of overwatch and it will fix it i tested it out and it seemed to work i was able to um access my time almanac even in the future because a lot of times some people will say that they can open it in the present day but they can't in the future now i had the issue where i could not open it anywhere and not only did it do it from one game uh, but it kind of traveled over into my other games too because when I was playing a personal game, it eventually happened to me. I was able to open it one time and then after that, the thing just wouldn't open at all. So uh, if you're the type to use mods, go ahead and get that latest mod. That will that will fix it. At least it did for me. And um, when you read this on the website, you'll be able to kind of tell, uh, you'll be able to see that this is true. And otherwise, you know, you just have to wait for EA to come out with a with a fix for it. And who knows when that's going to happen. <laughs> but yeah, it's it's a pain in the butt. It shouldn't happen that way. And especially if you're going to be doing a lot of traveling into that future, you're going you're going to need that time almanac because it's going to tell you how to get those legacy statues. And it's going to tell you about your descendants. And and you're going to need that to trigger, um, you, you know, you're going to need that to trigger the uh, the alternate futures. So um, I did want to inform you guys about that because. I've encountered that. It's a pain in the butt. Uh, I spent probably two or three hours today trying to figure out um, ways to fix it. And it, it really ate into my recording time, which I was really pissed off about because I, I wanted to try to get like four or five episodes of different LPs done today. But because I had to do that research, uh, it kind of really cut into my time. But at least I found out the information that you guys may need to, need to know if you are having that issue. So uh, if you're the type, you know, as I said, install that mod. If not, well, <laughs> you'll have to wait till they come out with a fix. 
So anyway, uh, it's it's not the greatest, and it's too it's it's a shame that you really need a mod to help fix it. It shouldn't be that way because some people don't like to play with mods. But anyway, that is that is my opinion about that. Don't forget to enter my random giveaway. The deadline is actually going to be Saturday, November 2nd. So you still got some time to enter that. And you'll find directions on how to do that on the video. So please listen to the video and read the uh, instructions on the uh, description bar. Now, uh, because we do have Into the Future, it's going to kind of affect uh, some of my LPs a little bit because there's going to be some of them that we can't actually send into the future and incorporate that. And... Um, so, and some of the other LPs are going to be making a comeback now that we have Into the Future and stuff. Um, I think it's a good time for them to do that little comeback. So be on the lookout for some 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 uh, very old and favorite visitors coming back. Like uh, we're going to start up with the All Skills Challenge again with Carrie Adamson. Now, who she's actually still at university, but we're going to go ahead and get her out of university. Because um, I think, if I remember correctly, last time she was actually on her last day there. So we'll get her out of university and we'll get her back home. Uh, we'll get some, a couple more skills level, skill levels, I think. And then we're going to, we'll prob probably travel into the future with her. Now, uh, Adrian, I think we're going to travel into the future with her too. She, um, now it is an Island Paradise LP, but we can go ahead and incorporate that. And we'll have them take a little trip into the future just to kind of see how things are going there and, uh, see if there's uh, any future people that would like a mermaid, you know, kind of thing. So that's that's going to be awesome. But uh, be on the lookout for some old visitors that's that uh, that we haven't seen for quite a while, and um, we're gonna just uh, see how interesting the future is going to impact some of these LPs. So anyway, guys, that's all I have to say. Uh, you guys have a great weekend. Have a fantastic day. Uh, stay tuned for more LPs, which um, you guys should have plenty to watch this weekend, as I said earlier. Uh, have a fantastic day. We'll talk to you guys all later. Bye, guys.